Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel. My name is Kani Handayani and in this video I would like to explain about types of the pets. Actually, there are 14 types of the pets, but in this video I can only discuss 3 types of them. Okay, let's do the first. That is recount text. Recount text is a text that telling the reader about a story, action, or activity. The social function of recount text is to retell events for the purpose of informing or entertaining the reader. To more understand about recount text, we're going to analyze the example of recount text. From the example of recount text, we can see the generic structure of recount text. There are three generic structures. One is orientation. In the orientation, it gives the readers the background information needed to understand the text, such as what's involved, where it happened, and when it happened. In the second is events. A series of events ordered in a chronological sense. And the last is reorientation. A personal comment about the event or what happened in the end. From the example of recount text, you can see the significant lexical grammatical features that is used. First, use past tense. Second, focus on specific participant. We can see in the text that is red color. And the three is use of material process. We can see in the text is blue color and the last is circumstances and place we can see in the green color okay let's do the second type that is descriptive text what is descriptive text descriptive text is a text which says what a person or a thing is like it is proposed to describe and reveal a particular person, animal, place, or thing. The generic structure of descriptive text, that is identification, contains about the introduction of a person, place, animal, or object will be described. And the second is description, contains a description of something such as animal, things, place, or present by describing its features, forms, colors, or anything related to what the writer described. We can see in the example of description text. From the example of descriptive text, the significant lexical grammatical feature that is used is first, use of simple present tense. Second is focus on specific participant. We can see in the yellow color. And the last is use of attributive and identifying process. We can see in the red color. Okay, let's do the last types that I can explain in this video. That is procedure text. So what is procedure text? Procedure text is a text that is designed to describe how something is achieved through a sequence of action or steps. It explains how people perform different process in a sequence of steps. So the social function of procedural text to show how something is accomplished through a sequence of action or steps. The generic structure of procedural text that is first goal it is contains the purpose of the text for example how to make a cup of coffee and the second is material or ingredients it is contains of the material that is used in the process for example material to make a cup of coffee and in the third is steps it is contains of the steps to make something in the goal 
C from the text of example of procedure text. The example of procedure text. The significant lexical grammatical feature that is used is first use of simple present tense or imperative tense. Second is use mainly of temporary conjunction. You can see in the orange color. And the last is used mainly of material process. You can see in the green color. I think that's all for me about three types of the text. That is account text, descriptive text, and procedure text. Hope you understand the material that I have explained. So thank you for watching this video. The last essay. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.